If you publish your app, you also want to showcase all the software licenses your app uses, like packages, dependencies and so on. And therefore we want to integrate our licenses with the Flutter view or we also want to add our custom view to display our licenses. If you are new here, subscribe to my channel and make sure to watch this video till the end. Let's get started with our first button, simple licenses, and this is this button. And if we click on this button, then we execute here our functionality. Here inside, you can simply call this method show license page, which is part of the Flutter SDK. And here you need to supply your contacts. You also need to set your application name. Next, you can also set your app logo. And therefore I have here this assets logo inside of my assets folder. And here I have my logo inside, which I also put inside of the PubSpec Jamal file. Under Flutter, you need to add all your assets to load this logo. And we already can try this simple case out. So I click on this button and you see we will land here at a new page, which shows all of our licenses. And you can then basically click here inside and then you can read about all the licenses. And like you can see also here at the top, our app name is displayed and also our logo. And we also want to have here more space between our logo and our app name. And therefore I wrap here around our logo some padding. And now you see we have here more space to all sides. And lastly, you can also add here your app version and you can also add your legalese, so your copyright of your company. And now you see that our app version was integrated and also our copyright. Alternatively, we can also create our own page, which then displays all the licenses. And therefore I simply push here to our own simple page. And within this new page, I put then a license page inside and I put then all the fields inside, which we had before inserted. And this is basically doing the same thing. So it's also displaying here our licenses and also our app logo, app name and so on. However, now you also have the advantages that you can wrap here around your theme object easily. And then you can supply here, for example, a dark theme. And now you see that our page adapted to the dark mode and we have here white text and a black background. Next, we want to build our custom page and here we also display then all of our licenses, however, with our custom design. Therefore, let's add the functionality of our next button and here I basically push to a new page, which we want to create right now. Inside of this page, we want to create a new method to load all of our licenses and you can get all your licenses by calling the license registry. And here you have access to a licenses stream and we want to map these licenses to our own object. And therefore I have created here my model object, which has then the title of our license and the main text of our license. And now we want to convert this license object, which we get from Flutter to our license object so that we have more comfortable usage. First of all, we want to get our license title and this is pretty simple. You simply call here license.packages and we also join them. And this is because we can have multiple packages with the same license text and then they are displayed here with a line break in between. And lastly, we want to get here our license paragraphs and you can see between each paragraph we have here some space and that's also what we want to do. And therefore we go here over our license and here we get the paragraphs and then we also want to join them and also add some space between our paragraphs. And the last thing is to basically create our license object, which we have created before. And here we basically put our title and our text inside. And this method then returns a list of licenses and we can then display them in our UI. Therefore, we go to our scaffold body property and here inside we want to create a future builder so that we can await all of our licenses. And here we basically get then a list of licenses, which we return by this method. And we put then here inside of the future, this load licenses method inside. And next we simply need to display our licenses. So we want to display every time the title and under it, the paragraphs. And therefore we create here this builder and then we get here with the snapshot data, all of our licenses. And this is then a list of license. And now we simply create a new widget, which displays all of these licenses. Within this new licenses widget, we get then all the licenses which we want to display right now. And within the build method, I create then a list view builder. And here I put then the licenses length in our item count. And I also want to go over all of our licenses, which I get by the index. And here we get then the individual license, which we want to display. 
And therefore I simply return here a list tile and within the list tile we display then the license title and we also display here the subtitle which is our main text of our license. And before we can then display our licenses widget, we also go again to our registry page and we wrap here this around with this switch connection state so that we have here first of all the loading case displayed. So if we are loading the licenses, then we want to show here a progress indicator in the middle and we also catch some errors which could occur. And now we can try it out. So I click here on this button and you see he is loading these licenses and is also displaying them in our UI. And now we can go back to our licenses widget and we want to modify a bit this UI. So first of all, I want to add some spacing around our title and therefore I simply wrap here a container inside and then I add some vertical spacing. And now we have here at the top and at the bottom some spacing. And lastly, we also add some padding to our list view. And in total, we make use of this license registry to get all of our licenses, which our app uses. And this is then displayed here in this view. And at the end, we also want to display here our custom licenses so we can choose our text for all of these licenses and can decide how our view looks like. Therefore, you simply add here this licenses JSON file inside of your assets folder. And here you can then modify the text of your licenses. So let's say you add this provider in your Flutter application and now you want to add the license. So you go here to this MIT license and here you can basically copy all of the license text. And after this, you could use here this text compare website to stringify your text. And therefore you simply paste here this text inside which you copied from this license. And then you click on show output and this will then generate here this string. And then you simply add here this title provider and here you can manually add then this text which you have stringified. And within this file you can then add all the dependencies which you want to show in your UI later. And then you can basically copy here this whole registry page and then we also want to create here our own custom page. And what we want to modify here is only this method load licenses. And here inside we basically get first of all the asset bundle and then we can basically load here our licenses from our assets. And therefore I put here this assets licenses JSON file inside which we have integrated inside of our assets folder and here we basically have our licenses JSON file. And then we get here all of our licenses as a string and we want to convert here these licenses first of all to JSON and after this we want to convert it to our license object and this is what you can easily do with this license from JSON which I have implemented already. And here inside you basically extract then the title and also the JSON text which we have put here inside of our JSON. And this is all what we need to load all of our licenses from our assets. And now we can click here on this custom licenses button and then all of our licenses are displayed here inside. And these are exactly the licenses which we have here within our licenses JSON file defined. Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel here to get the latest news about Flutter. And see you soon, bye!